All right, recruiting for college basketball begins at the high school level and even junior high level. But for two USF women basketball players, the recruiting journey started much earlier. John Sable explains why the USF experience will last a lifetime. Nina Paholke and Micah Kroll spent most of their time growing up on basketball courts. But their love for the game went to a different level when they started attending Jose Fernandez's youth USF basketball camps. I think I went to every one of Coach's camps, probably. Uh, his team camps, individual camps, I was always here. I went to the, when they played Indiana, I don't remember how old I was. And we were little ball girls at Indiana, which was fun. The girls continued to keep in close contact with Coach as they grew up. And at the end of high school, they had offers to play at smaller Division II schools. But ultimately, they accepted offers as walk-ons at USF. It's a perfect match. It was meant to be that I'm supposed to play basketball. And for Coach Jose, it's just, it was something that was remarkable. Do you think, like, this is weird. Like, this is where I grew up. Like, basketball kind of started. It didn't start, but in a way it did. It's almost like I know they're, they're walk-ons and they're, they're members of my basketball team now. But uh, I've, I've watched them and seen them grow up. The girls and Coach Fernandez have built a very strong relationship on and off the court that goes beyond the X's and O's of basketball. And it all started at the same court where they play now. Coach was such a father figure to me, even at a young age. If I have a husband or a kid that's a boy growing up, like I hope he becomes half the man that Coach is. To say that, is, it, it, that means a lot. I think it's, it's, it's why you do this. It's not, you know, all the time about winning and losing games. Reporting at USF, John Sable, ABC Action Sports.